every time I come to your country, your people are very nice. They've been very nice to me. They've always said, Anavab, thank you for coming. Your English is very good. <laughs> now, here's the thing, London. I didn't want my English to be very good. <laughs> to be honest, I didn't even want to speak it. But about 250 years ago, <laughs> we're going there. <laughs> Some British people, about this number, actually. <laughs> I remember you, sir, you built the railways <laughs> in India. There's a gentleman going, yes, I did, yeah. <laughs> Some British people came over to India and told us, speak like this. And we said, why, 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 why? And you said, well, we've got a gun. <laughs> and if there's a gun pointed in your face, you learn a language very quickly. Parlez-vous français, yes, yes. And you said, English is an easy language. Very simple to learn. Write down, Salisbury. <laughs> S-A-L-S-B-S-A-L-I-S-B-U. Why didn't the French invade us? <laughs> oh, masculine, feminine, no, this is better. <laughs> you said it gets easier, it gets easier, Anavab. It's an easy language. Write down, Siobhan. <laughs> Here's an even easier one, pneumonia. And <laughs> P starts with a P. <laughs> Who are these people? <laughs> By the way, before I begin, I realize some people might be late. They might be coming in, um, and you may feel like you want to go out. Uh, I'll be honest with you, this is a show about the British Empire in India. So if you're British, you can come and go whenever you want. <laughs> it's not a traditional comedy show. <laughs> You've walked in and out of India before, it'll happen again. <laughs> anyway, it was going fine under the circumstances. There was a gun pointed. We were learning a language. 200 years, we did everything that the British people told us. Yes, sir, no, sir, good evening, hello. Namaste, how are you? Yeah, lovely. <laughs> Sorry, what? You'd like us to wear a three-piece woolen suit in the middle of the Indian summer? I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> but then suddenly, without telling any of us, middle of the night, 1947, all the British people in India suddenly just got up and fucked off. <laughs> World's first Brexit. <laughs> Leaving half a billion people sounding like this. <laughs> like a love child of Downton Abbey and a Bangalore call centre. <laughs> And before the British left, we said, excuse me, before you go, you there, yes, Horace, yes. <laughs> hello, yes, you and your friend Reginald, yes, hello. Yes, what do you want us to do with this language, please? Because you're leaving, I have no one to speak to. My granddad can't understand a word I'm saying. <laughs> and the British said, keep the language, Anavab, keep the language. Talk amongst yourselves. Because you never know, in 75 years, when the whole world is connected with fiber optic cable. <laughs> and when our Barclays debit cards don't work, you can answer our phones. <laughs> what was your name, Anavab? Would you mind terribly changing it to Gareth? <laughs> Thank you for watching Solar Theatre on YouTube. Subscribe now for more best comedy.